This is my $10,000 sneaker collection. I used to work at Foot Locker, that's how I got started. And let me show you around. These were my babies. I used to wear these every single day. Little background story real quick. In high school, I wasn't allowed to wear sneakers or Jordans or anything like that. We could only wear Sperry's. We could only wear flats, heels. So right away, I got a job at Foot Locker once I hit 16. And these were my first sneakers I bought. The Shadow Ones. These are my favorite because obviously they're black, gray, and white. Very neutral, go with everything. They go fire with this fit. All right now, the classics. These are the band. The bread band ones, you know, it's just a classic colorway. Anything bread, Chicago. I always say these are my beaters, my gamma blues. I just tore these things up, if you can see. They're real beat, um, but the blues coming off the front of them. Can you see that? The glue's coming off the front. They're still intact, so I'm still gonna wear them, you hear me? Jordan 3s are my absolute Favorite silhouette, they're so comfy on my feet. They're just sick, like, they're just a beautiful sneaker. These black cement threes, you can wear with anything, pretty much. You can make fit go crazy with these. By the box, you should already know what this is. I'm gonna give a shout out to Cola Kicks 843 for hooking me up with the Amamanir threes. Definitely my grail sneaker. Super grateful to Cola Kicks 843 for hooking me up. I got the Jordan one on my Meniers. We got the Mocha ones. Love these. These go with a lot of things. Court Purple 2.0s. These are the Royal. Royal Toe? I don't know. These are something. I forget. But yeah. Now we got the Fire Red 3s. 7210. These are the highest. The lows just recently dropped. These, I don't even know what these are called. I mean, I know what they're called. Comma de Garcons. But I don't know how to pronounce it. These are the metallic fives. But if you got a blue pair, you gotta have a red pair. Kinda goes hand in hand. So that's why I got these. I had these and I was like, man, I need an all red pair. So I got these. These are my Panda Dunk Highs. Everybody knows what these are. I have the Cherry Lows. Then we got the True Blue, True Blue Threes. These were my first pair of threes. I know True Blues are a classic. I didn't really understand the value in having these. These are the Tapa Hayes 4s. People are going crazy for the 4 silhouette. I'm not really a fan. I had the white cement 4s. I had to get rid of them because they didn't fit me. I'm pretty much ready to sell these, honestly. I don't even know why I got these. So if you were a size 5 and you're interested, let me know. I'll sell them to you. These are Space Jams. Classic sneakers. These are aging pretty well. Love wearing these. They go with everything. Shout out to Sneaker Exit. Hyper Royals are traded in a couple different Jordans for these. Then we got the Pollen Jordan ones. I really wanted these because the box was black and yellow. That's bad, but these are actually tough. As soon as I bought them, I put them on my feet. They actually match with a lot of outfits I have. I didn't realize how much yellow I own until I got these. Um, these are the Infrared 2s. I usually put these on when I want to be different. Like when I went to Sneak Drag Z, I put them on. Not a lot of people like twos, and I like to be different. These are my favorite twos that I've ever dropped. <laughs> I haven't even put these on um, in a while. I'm missing the shoelaces. I think I had put red shoelaces on these. So, but these are the cool gray threes. As you can see, I've worn them a little bit. These are the Georgetown threes. I didn't think they were nice. My girlfriend Mel bought these for me. I didn't think they were nice because I really wanted the Georgetown ones. But actually when I sit back and I put the white laces on them, these are actually fire. Fred sixes, I actually got these off Poshmark. Um, me and my old friend, she used to get all her sneakers um, used and off Poshmark and eBay and all that stuff before the whole big wave of people started loving J's. These are the maroon sixes. Kind of. The bottoms are pretty messed up. Like it's like purple. I don't really know. So I haven't worn these since. I don't know really. I don't know what I've done to them. But if you know, in the comments, let me know. I just love elevens. Like elevens are just so fresh to me. These concords have been my grail. I have my favorite color is purple. If you didn't know, now you know. And the fact that these have purple on the bottom, 
I just needed them. So I recently added these to, to the collection. So I paid resale for these. Cool Gray 11s. I've wanted these since my freshman year of high school, I believe. I used to see all the seniors. I used to see everybody wearing these and I'm like, I didn't want them so bad. Then we got the Harris Velvet 11s. These are tough. These are really, really limited. I remember me and my brother, I was still working at Foot Locker in Connecticut and I had to wake up early to wait in line to get these. It was Christmas time. Bread 11s, can you tell the difference between the two? <laughs> and crazy story, some reseller sold me fake Jordans. I didn't know they were fake until I caught the real pair from Nike. I compared the two and there's a lot of differences between the two. I did a whole video on it before. I had to delete it because of lawyers and lawsuits and stuff like that. But, so I just wear them because I paid more than I paid for the real ones. So I wear the mess out of my reps. I don't care, all right? So we got the Legend Blues, really classy sneaker. The only dunks in my collection are the Michigan Dunks. Me and my girlfriend both have these. I bought them so that we could match. They're supposed to be Obsidian ones. I don't purposely buy reps to wear. These I bought for show, like I wanted to just have them on the shelf sitting. And um, they're so bad. Anyone who's into sneakers can tell these are fake as soon as they see the video. So I was like, uh, no. Panda Dunk Glows, these are obviously reps. If you can't tell the shininess coming off of these, it's crazy. Um, these are actually for a prank. Final sneaker and best sneaker in my collection. Well, technically not final. As you can see, I have some blazers, I have a pair of Yeezys, I have Vans. So my collection is way beyond 10,000, including those sneakers. I used to love Heelers when I was younger. So as soon as I saw them for $20 at Foot Locker, this was like three months ago, I wanna say. I had to buy them. I haven't worn them again since that day in the mall, but y'all gonna get a YouTube video with me wearing be a funny video comment down below what kind of video i should do with these heels 